Tuck oh, move. Tuck move. I've got M's pretty much everywhere. I will wait for the... OF2 and OF3. OF1 looks okay. Tuck move swap, please, Atlanta. Here comes the tuck move swap. something called data bus couplers, but we got it back with the swap thing. <laughs> oh, okay. Data bus couplers. Little data bus couplers. Little data bus with coupler failure. All right. Nav aids are next. Yeah, there is a lot of, a lot more than normal. Yep. We see some low excursions there at Atlantis. We expect density shears. Are you right? Yeah, we're seeing them, thanks. That's what, when in doubt, just call it density shear. It makes you sound intelligent. Yeah. Yeah, I thought that was nice. All right, sights on the nose. I don't believe there's like massive variations in the Earth's density, the hey. atmosphere density of 184,000 feet. I just had my landing gear down light come out. Sounds good though. No, that's not good. Did yours come out for Yeah, hey, uh, sure. uh, Did we hear like the landing gear come down, uh, John? No, because all your up blocks are still up. Up blocks are up, They're it's fine. just the light. Maybe that was the density shear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we didn't hear anything, John, did we? It'd be the main landing gear shearing off. Okay. I just called to yeah, you tell. Yeah. Decent Atlantis. Uh, both sides of the cockpit have the down landing gear light eliminated. The uh, talkbacks all still show up. Yeah, just coming to you with that, Chunky. We see that uh, gear down push button eliminated or enabled, so we recommend that you wait to push both push buttons at 300 feet. And that will, because uh, the gear will probably deploy with any single push button that's actuated. I do not have an axe. And I got dual commanders over here. Can I tell them it looks just like the other run, or would that be cheap? Yeah. Oh, dual commanders, oh, commanders. Yeah. yeah. I got dual commanders. Just dual commanders. Dual commanders, please too. select, yeah, BSS yeah, CRT 2 plus 3. Here it comes. Yeah, give the BFS what it wants. All right, you get the BFS over BFS there now. there, pass is still here. Yep. Okay, so okay that cleaned it up, Butch, thanks. Here comes a system here. You bet, and Chunky just confirmed no gear arm at 2K. Yeah, confirm. Uh, we'll get the arm and down at 300 feet. How copy? There you go, good plan. Uh, auto auto B. Okay, thanks. Speed break is next. Or swap. Yeah, it's swap Looks like Edward Tackin is down Atlantis, so we'll take secondary Tackin on spec 50 with an item 5. Item 5, spec 50 for secondary Tackin. Item 5 to pass looks good. This is secondary Tackin. All right, help me to check it. Is. I'll check the BFS, make sure it is. Big leak on APU 1 Atlantis. We expect it Great. to drop here in just a few. Okay, copy. Big leak APU 1. Uh, we're on the uh, primary, still on BFS. You can read back. You can uh, take GPS. Take GPS. You channel 21 on attack, and it is a copy good. big leak. GP, GPS, right? Sorry about that. Take yep. GPS, yeah. 42, please. Atlantic, take back in. Got it. Take back in. 19 looks good to the BFS. It's not that big. Back in. One is in it now. It's probably just the roll. Here's the item 19. Yep. Which is good. all it good. That Field was quantities at 43, Chunky. I see that. It's, it's, not, it's not huge. Not, okay. Well. Now it's 42. I mean, it's. Yeah, I see what 41. you're saying. Yeah, I don't but, think it's going to make it to the ground. But. No, but it's not going to expire in the next five seconds either. All righty. And it. Uh, uh, so we got an APU fuel leak, so that might have some uh, post landing impacts there, Rexy. Don't want to forget. Which one? APU fuel, fuel leak. Okay. APU fuel leak on one. It's at 37 percent right now. I'll let you know when it gets to about five. Okay, thanks. Hey Sandy, there's no reason to tack in one work, is there? That you could think of? Uh, no. Okay. We haven't had anything that would affect tack in. Plus, you know, they called all the tack ins are whirly, so maybe hey. that one. All right, we're in red, blowing both. Okay. So next is probes at five. Agreed. Yep. So 
rolling with AP1 going down we prox box. Here. The perfectly intuitive display of range versus velocity. That's what everybody flies, isn't it? Range versus velocity charts, yeah. Uh, VVI is in, uh, yeah, in that very common thing of feet per second. <laughs> there it goes. Uh, 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 20%. That's Phase A, phase, oh, that's a bummer. Phase A and phase B are down for AC2. Uh, Captain, we've had a face-to-face -face short. You can drop AC2. Okay, I'll drop all of AC2. All right, AC2, I'm pushing in the buttons. Happy. I see AC2. Okay, all three are in. to drop all of AC2. Okay, there you go. Yep, here we go. And here we go. AC2 bus loss actions. AC2. We'll also take a bomber to Charlie bus here comes a Bravo to Charlie. Okay, and your... Verify good bus type, which... Looks like AC2 bus loss action is in work, Houston. AC2 is dropped. Okay. We do see a good tight chunky. You can shut down fuel cell 2. You can leave the react open, no power down. Uh, he probably means 1. No, he means 2. Oh, fuel cell 2, I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm looking at APU data. Here comes, uh, off. here comes fuel cell uh, number 2, Butch. Master match, you get it? Got it. We're tied. You got your steps, you only read We're ready. I'm, I'm working them now. Okay. All right, dropping the bus. That's right. We're down to 8% on the fuel for AP1. Okay. We're going to expect that message momentarily. Uh, okay. Stand by on the probes. Yep. Hey, Sandy. What do we got to do? Got Barlow Control Heater tank, 2 to uh, Alpha. Close tank, ISO 1 and 2 on the left RCS. L1L is failed on. Get it, Perky. Barlow Control Heater 2 to Alpha, 1 to Bravo. Left, right, left, 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 Copy, uh, I am you want down in the backup, good pass. Okay, check probes out. Uh, my uh, AC uh, two bus bus sections are complete. So are mine. Yeah. Left probe is out. Right probe is out. I cannot arm the drag chute. It'll be single no, motor time on. All right, let's probes, talk about correct. gear here. Let's yeah. talk about gear. Yeah, gears, uh, yeah. We're down, we're down to box box, we're down high system one. So yeah. we have a single gear deploy method. We cannot arm the gear because it will come down if we arm the gear. Yeah, you can't arm it early. So this is the challenge here. What do you do? Do we arm it and have it the risk it come down? Now this is a great case. <laughs> this is awesome. Uh, we need to jump out if we're not going to do this. You know I, what I mean? I can't wait to hear what they're going to yeah. do. You know, if the, okay, if the gear comes down, we know what we do. Um, Close to any point, Close speed brakes to auto. Speed brakes to yeah, and we're fine at that point. All right, so... Hey, check your data. All right, here we go. Um, this is a great case. I lost talk back up there. Too. As long as you can take air data. Take air data. Okay. And wait to hear what they're going to do. Um, 25 looks good. 28 looks good. That's and then the yeah, BFS. 25 looks good to pass. I'd say arm it, and if the gear comes Atlantis, down. Atlantis, we are down to single method of gear deploy. We've lost prop box number two. We see that. We do still recommend uh, the dual TB at 300 feet. If we can, we're looking to see if we can get back AC2 phase alpha to bring us back redundancy. Okay, copy also. Uh, obviously, no early gear arm. And that will just uh, risk it all at 300 feet. So they're talking about bringing back there you go. alpha. Good, good uh, assumption. Yeah, that's what they're talking about. All right, so I'm going to pull out the Bravo and Charlie circuit breaker. Yeah, so when we power it up, we have alpha. alpha. Copy. Copy. All right, so we're in a good config if we need to go get the alpha phase back. Oh, Bailey, now at 300 feet. Okay, HUD powered. Yeah, good call. All right, now the shoot uh, for buff loss for AC2 is by... If you get it, we'll take rack controller loop one to auto A. If not, we'll get it post landing. Loop one coming to auto A. I go check on that. That might be bigger than that. Yeah, I got shoot arm, pilot shoot arm for AC2. Does that mean Perky's got to arm the chute? 
pilot chute arm for AC2 priming, so I have to arm it, yeah. which we're going to do all that at, at 300 feet. No, not that. Shoot. Oh, shoot arm. I'm yeah. sorry. So you'll have to get that. Yeah. I have that under main B, not under AC2. Chucky, two things. If okay, you'll open break right. ISOL number two, then we're going to try and have you repower AC2 phase alpha only. All right, ISOL 2 is open. Uh, whenever you're ready, I can, I've can. i got the AC2 phase alpha circuit breaker pushed in. I'm ready to bring the inverter power and the AC bus back on. We're ready. I see it. All right. Okay. Everybody happy? Everybody. We put our visors on. Ooh, that didn't look good. <laughs> uh, that didn't work. That didn't work. I don't see anything on the system. Uh, I might want to tell. Houston, uh, the talkbacks did not move with uh, either switch actuation for inverter power or inverter AC bus. Yeah, this is evil. Yeah, I think I've got everything set up right. We see good inverter power, not a good inverter bus indication. Stand by. Okay. Got that phase A. I can't see that. The circuit breaker's in, right? This one is in. Yeah. Uh, and coming up on Mach 1. All right, you do it. You do the flying stuff. I'll do the right. flying stuff. All right, that's so what I do. I'll work, I'll work this if I need to. I don't want us to do the old L1011 in the Everglades here. So right All right, Tucker, let's go ahead and uh, turn it back off. We'll consider AC2 phase alpha down as well. Okay, we'll uh, just take the uh, inverter power back to off. All right, the button's in. That'll work. Right, We're also right. on energy approaching the hack. We got no changes to wind or weather. You are nominal shoot. Copy. Uh, no changes and nominal shoot. All right, we got one gear deployed method. We're going to try it at 300 feet. If it doesn't work, we're going to skid our way into oh, the actually, end. Actually, we have redundancy for the nose gear and the left main gear, but not the right. And he's uh, 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 feedback from the uh, uh, talkback. Just confirm the inverter power is back off. It's going to be worse. <laughs> yeah, it's worse. Next time it is off, yeah. It's going to be an all or nothing. We are cross-strapped to antenna electronics one and string two, everything else. See it, CSS, Fergie. CSS all. Okay, do not let me arm the gear at uh, 2,000 feet. Oh, we still make it. And nine, barely. Yeah. Five, we're close to any point. Four, three, two, one. Be right, turn on the hack. See it in the turn. I didn't get to see you sooner. We will take high speed on APUs two and three. Yeah, our fault. Butch, sorry about that. Uh, actually, Rex, with the, are, are you looking at the talkback? Is that why you're telling me yeah. it's just the part? Minus on at the 180. Talkbacks are not going to be the AC. Yeah, they'll either all come down or none of them will come down. Just the way I'm thinking about this. If you lose actually, the, the you nose lose, will come down. If you lose pyro system one, or sorry, box box one, you'll still, reverse logic will still give you the left main gear. Here we are, the 90. Right. Two, I think. Broken at eight is the weather. I just review, you're going to push both buttons at 300 feet. I am, and you're going to get the shoot. Although, I'll, should I just try it? Have it, because I yeah, have it under main it's B. It's just main B, it's not AC2. Yeah. Okay, I'll try it then. Don't worry about it first. They usually tell us those kind of yeah, things. Yeah, I was going to say. Atlantis on at the 90. On at the 90. Sorry, right, I just kept it. You seem too busy. Ah, it's all right. Um, yeah. This is long as you let me fly a little bit on the real day. <laughs> I'll probably be a little more antsy then. All right. What are they going to do to the final? Uh, yeah. Okay, should have a couple thousand feet. We should break out. Kind of on 10,000 feet. I got the field good overlay. Field sight. Body spot the trail. I see it on the close end. Happy landing. Field in sight. 9,000. It's off a little bit right, but I think it's converging. Yeah, I'm just going to fly good. Okay. Uh, we are 3 and 1 on the close end. That would be 7,000. The one that has a little ramp. 6,000. We don't have any leads against the rat alts, do we? No. Okay, thank you. 5,000 radar. Check in one. Mine looks good. It is good. I'm going to go to two, and that's good. 4,000. Don't arm the gear. I know. I was just going to say that I'm not arming. I'm no not arming. arming. 3,000. Speed break is going to 30. 2,000. Pre-flare next. 
Don't arm the gear. I'm not arming the gear. I'm still not arming the gear. <laughs> okay. Max is 308. You're at 1,000 feet. My fingers are on both buttons. 600, 500, 400. Line up. Here comes the gear. Here. I got two lights. I've okay. got one talk back in motion. I think they're sort of moving. Okay. Oh, I'm down in a minute. 100, 250. I don't have an indication in the HUD. 50, 240. 30, 225. 20, 220. Let her come down. 10, 5. Okay. Uh, they're down. Sounds like they're here. They work. Yeah. D rotate. D rotate. I uh, have a rate. I don't think they can emulate the scraping sound that the body flat makes it on. We skid across the runway. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm kind of glad I don't have a window seat. For All that right. Case. Uh, looks like your brakes are good. That's six board. Nominal braking. I'm going to get to shoot at 60. Shoot. All right, we had a few leaks that so we're probably going to be... We'll stop Houston. Get now. Yeah, AP Lannis, Chunky will take APUs off ASAP. You are expedited power down for the APU steel leak. Mode 5 egress to the 12 o'clock position. We'll take kill cell 1. 